So far we hike for two and a half hours. How many? Two and a half. Two and a half. Huh? Two and a half. Not quite sure if we are still on the right way. Might ask some people over there. But it was actually the only way to go. And we should be pretty close to Ping An village already because we are hiking now for three hours. That from Dachai to Ping An takes three to four hours, but um, yeah, let's see. Not much to see here. So you might ask yourself if you should go left and follow the main road, but as curious as I am, just want to check out where to go. And then you find this sign that it is going to Pingan village, this way down there. Finally made it. It's fantastic. We are running out of water. People getting hungry. Now it's 3.15. So as I just said, it took us th three hours. Oh, awesome. Let's have a look. The others might come soon. Parking lot, toilet to the village. There we are. Yeah, Pingan village from the viewpoint of nine dragons and five tigers. It's a pity that the terraces are not flooded yet. Huh? But it's beautiful.
on the way to the viewing platform called Seven Stars and the Moon. Let's see how Pingan Village and the rice terraces around look like from this viewpoint. And after this, I guess we head down and get our rooms at the hostel. Settle a little bit, refresh, get something to eat and drink, and relax. So it seems that we are circling the valley and the village because before the nine tigers or nine dragons five tigers platform was here so now we walked around this whole thing pretty nice A lot of foreigners, much more tourists here in this village. I did more traveling outside of the cruise ship in the Caribbean, I feel the same way. To be pretty careful with this floor, the stones so slippery at some point. It's unbelievable. And then again, around the corner will be some of the Yao people. They want to have five kwai that you can take a photo with them. There they are. I bet you're gonna ask me. And about those Yao people, it's one of the fifty five or fifty six ethnic minorities here in China and they only cut their hair once in their lifetime when they're between 16 to 18 and they reach their adulthood so then they cut their hair, the women and after this never ever again so they twist it up like a turban as you can see yeah, much more touristy here, Ping An village. Let's see where to go. The girls are behind. Paul is already in front of me, somewhere. Hello. Hi. Selling all this stuff. Oh, that's how it looks like. And they're flooded. I guess we reached the seven stars and the moon. Actually, I wanted to take time lapse of the sunrise this morning. Set my alarm to 5:30. Bit ripped and super heavy rain, so I hope. Tomorrow morning I can do it here. Oh, they are pretty set up, huh? That's Paul. There we are. Let's go. We were choking around at the hostel. It's here where we are, the two flags. Oh, no, we are here. 
So this is what's gonna happen. Kids just piss in the middle of the way. It's just gonna happen in China. Look at this. Where are the parents? They super don't give a fuck. Yeah, they are the parents. So long T means dragon's backbone. I guess they're referring to this thing here. Which looks like a sleeping dragon in the mountain. <laughs> Could just pee in the middle of the way and now everyone is happy. Well done. <laughs> Some pirated stuff. <laughs> Yeah, finally, the emperor, the sea done. You can, you can pay them like 200, 300 coin. They carry you up the hill. Why? Oh, that's those old men. It's so pity for them. Jesus. She's dancing around. Those people have the best spot here on the rice terraces, huh? Very nice.